Hi, it's my time to shine. I'm just checking myself. Crack up. Anyway, I'll be doing some readings. So you are the tape will resonate and need a rest. Hopefully I won't get no more interruptions. I guess people mad because I told them, please stop texting me. Shit getting on my nerves. I meant to put my phone on do not disturb. I just don't want my grandberry baby now. People getting over. Because I don't be deep. I had my shit on the do not disturb for weeks. It's just nothing that I want to hear. If it ain't I don't have if it ain't you have money, I don't really want to hear it. I got shit going on and I gotta make moves. Time is flying. It's about to be February already. Overall energy is the six of pentacles. Which this is kind of a good card, honestly. This is somebody that give and take equally. Like they having a celebration. Everybody giving something to the table and taking. You feel what I'm saying? That's the type of friendships I want in relationships. And until I get that, my ex staying by myself. I'm not even having no intercourse with nobody. I ain't you ain't gonna just be taking from me and I ain't getting. I'm cooling. <laughs> For real. And it's Capricorn Taurus Virgo energy as well. Universe, spirit guy, holy angels, okay. Nine of Pentacles, damn. Somebody is not living the way they want to live at this time. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. What's the energy surrounding this reading, please? You came out that way. Damn, the king of wands. Somebody ain't making something happen. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Energy. Universe, okay. Let's see what else going on. Wow, the star. A lot of reversals. Somebody ain't getting something they hope and wish for. This could also mean a theft. Somebody could be stealing something from you or your energy, your time. Mmm. Aquarius energy. You gotta watch that. That's somebody that don't even have faith. They lack faith as well. And Sagittarius is lack faith. And Aries. What is the energy surrounding this read, please? You got the will. I mean, the world. You're not closing up a cycle. The Empress is upset. That was in my last two weeks about something. And the overall energy is a partnership, a relationship, or friendship. Maybe you marry somebody that's in the medical field. You could be dealing with a doctor, nurse. It could be anything in the medical field. But it's a two of cups. It's the overall energy. I'm just got the wand, the empress. The empress is mad. It's like everybody mad. The king of wands mad. Let's see. What is the energy surrounding the nine of pentacles? Strength. This came out too before. Somebody got to have strength about the situation. Could be Leo. What is the energy surrounding the nine of pentacles? Reverse, please, universe, spirit guides. Two came out. You got family life, the ten of cups, your emotions all intact, two of pentacles. You could be juggling two people. Or somebody's juggling two people, but they trying to stay balanced. In the family life, maybe they got two different families. See what I'm saying? Somebody could have two different families. And they trying to stay balanced. Let's see why this King of Wands here. Why he mad? What's up with this one? Okay. First card that turned over was the Six of Six of Swords. He want to leave the past behind or she and move forward with truth and clarity about the situation. Yeah, they at a crossroads. They got to make a decision. He may be or she got to make a decision between two people. Two, two, two. You should maybe see what the angel number that is. Yeah, and the two cups, two, two, two of cups, two of swords, and two of pentacles, two, four, six, equals a six. You should look up angel number six and two, two, two. But somebody need to make a blind decision. It's like somebody got to make a decision between two people. Because this empress is upset, and she's highly intuitive. Like, she's not even waiting for no, no, no choice. 
But I think they trying to move fast to make a decision because that Empress is out. Let me see who the star. What is the energy surrounding the star at this time? What is the energy surrounding the star at this time? Yeah, the moon. Secrets is coming out. Pisces, Scorpio energy. Yeah, it's some secrets coming out. What is the energy with the star? It's a lot of shit going on. Wow, the Queen of Swords. Somebody cutting somebody off with truth and clarity. So, yeah. This King of Wands probably messing with the Empress and the Queen of Swords. But the Empress mad. Like, you won't know she mad. But to me, it's like she just looked forward and just kept it moving. She, she, and that's the future. Like, but this Queen of Swords seemed like she cut this King off as well. So maybe that's why the King of Wands mad. Because he don't have nobody left. What is the energy surrounding the star? Reverse, please. What is the energy surrounding the star? Reverse. Pe Knight of Pentacles. Somebody want to offer you some type of abundance. Or somebody coming in. Woo. That's why I got this pillow back here. With some type of abundance. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. I want to go and see um, the near future with this world reverse. Like, yeah, somebody coming up out a lot of confusion with the five of wands. There's a lot of fire sign in here. It's a lot of confusion regarding in a relationship. It's like the two of cups is the overall energy. So somebody want marriage. Maybe somebody want to marry a nurse, a nurse or a doctor, a woman. Something in the medical field. That's where somebody want to go to. Yeah, the six of the cups. Reverse. Somebody from the past may be trying to stop this, this union. And their emotions is all over. Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Or maybe they want to marry somebody from their past. That's in the medical field. Two of cups, overall energy. They may want to marry somebody from their past. They want to end something. With somebody. Two of Wands. This is somebody not having the whole world in their hands that they thought they did. Told you, Fire Sign. Matter of fact, Fire Sign go here. Let me see what's up with this Empress. There's a lot going on here. Somebody's juggling two people. But... They only really want one, and they about to cut the other one off. But it's going, it's going to be some shit. Yeah, Ace of Wands and the Ace of Swords. Wow. Yes, it's coming from the divine. They get truth and clarity in the situation to make something happen with the Empress. Somebody want the Empress. Bottom line. They don't want nobody but the Empress. Even though the Queen of Swords may cut cut them off they don't care but it's like somebody else is, is is around here somewhere they want the empress they don't want the queen of swords bottom of the deck the hangman like they stuck on what they want they want this they they want the empress bottom line and it, it seems like the queen of swords is mad that's who he want if that's who he want he don't want you that's how these this is how these females be in these men. Yes, we don't want you. You still be trying to come, come at us. Hair on my face like. I don't know. I'm going to get one more card though for that Empress. And then I'm going to get my other card because I want to see what's going on. Yeah. Wow. Okay. I'm seeing something a little funny here. The lovers reverse. Somebody came out of a decision they made. They split from somebody. Gemini energy. Right? But then you got the Ten of Pentacles reverse. Somebody not happy. They don't got the home life, nothing. And, and I'm trying to figure out who is this. And then you got the um temperance, some patience. So somebody mad because they don't got the Ten of Pentacles with somebody. And as I tell you, the Empress is higher than the Queens. So it got to be this Queen in the near future. This got to be this Queen that's mad. She looked mad anyway. 
He may was juggling in the past. He got the strength to you know, overcome that and he realized that he want a family life with the Ten of Cups. He want to leave everything in the past. He, it's a choice he have to make. Basically, he want to go back to somebody from his past that he know. And this could be somebody in the medical field or she know. That's bottom line with this reading. Like, they, they don't... Wow. Yeah, they got a victory. Six of Wands? Yeah, they want, they, they, they know they're going to have a victory with somebody from their past. That's who they want. Like, they got a victory. They coming up out of getting away with shit. Like, they not in that energy no more. They coming up out of third-party situations with the Three of Cups. Couple of people mad. The King of Pentacles. So, I don't know. They coming up out of that energy. So, this they want union. With somebody from their past. That's what they want. And they ready to give everything up too. For it. That's a that's a good reading. Somebody that, that see the light before the light see them. Crack the hell up. But some people don't never get it. And they be wondering why people is out. So yeah, they might uh uh. They made a decision. They done. They wanna they don't want no more third parties. They don't want to play. They want a victory with their two of cups. Something woke them up. Universe, spirit, guy, holy angel. What is the energy for this read, please? What's the overall energy? Or what do some... Wow. I'm glad I didn't fall. You're so easy to see through. What do I feel with that card? Maybe the King of Wands feel that by the Empress. Because you know the Empress got it. She's, no matter what's going on, her head's straight, mad, or happy. And he see right through the Empress. Like, she acting like she don't care. But she loved that King of Wands. But she's not showing it. That's what I'm seeing. And he's saying, or she's saying, you're so easy to see through. You know you want me. <laughs> You know you want to marry me. And she do. Because that's what he want. And I think that's what she want. But you know the Empress don't come with bullshit. You got all that third party. She out. She a type that don't deal with nothing. She not going to argue about nothing. She don't confront nothing. She just move forward. No matter what her emotions is. She remind me of the Queen Elizabeth. Bottom fucking line. They don't show emotion. That's how I've been lately, too. I ain't showing no emotion. Mad, sad, happy. You ain't going to know shit about me. People feed off of when you're going through something. I noticed that, too. I noticed so much. I just thank the divine for opening my eyes. He already was open them before I, you know, I made a move last time. And he opened wider again, and I am loving it. Because people wear masks, and they is not who they see. Bottom line, I don't trust nothing. I was just telling somebody outside. They was like, yeah. Some guy, or whatever, rode by or something. And then someone was like, yeah, he don't be on the corner no more. He didn't change and this and that and other. I was just like, uh-huh. I was like, I was like, she was like, oh, because he been speaking to me all day. I'm like, that's on you. I was like, I don't care about nobody around here like that. And um, she was like, he changed his life. I'm like, everybody that get off the block don't change their life. They get off the block for other reasons. <laughs> Bottom fucking line. So... I don't, mm -mm. I don't deal with guys that's too bougie and you ain't got no money to be bougie about. Miss me with it. I look at you like you crazy. You can't be bougie and a guy and you ain't like that, like that. Mm -mm. I ain't the one. I just be looking. I, uh, all that waving and shit, that shit over. I'm done doing all that. I ain't speaking, I ain't being nice. Uh-uh, I'm done. I'm nice to those who are nice to me that I know now. Crack the fuck up. So, that's all I had to say for your reading. Crack the hell up.